Hello everyone, welcome to my channel and uh, the first video of hopefully a series as part of my 1897 challenge for the Blue Cross. Uh, so the Blue Cross is a wonderful charity, they help many pets and their owners uh, as well as helping animals who need hospital treatments, care and just generally giving the best life that they can to pets and their owners. If you'd like to know more about what the Blue Cross charity does, um, some of its fundraising campaigns, you can have a look on the Blue Cross website. Alternatively, please check out my social media. Um, I'm on YouTube, Twitter and Instagram. And also, if you'd like to donate, you can view all of my campaign on my Tiltify page uh, by scanning the QR code at the bottom of the screen. Today I'm going to start by playing Tie the Tasmanian Tiger. Uh, this was always a favourite game when I was a child. It was originally played on the PlayStation, so the graphics are a little bit uh, interesting, but I'm excited to give it a go. And uh, I should also say that because we've passed the first milestone of £50, I will be playing all of my games wearing my Team Cat uh, socks. So I'll put those on now so that you can see. Ready to go. Hope you enjoy. Don't be afraid, Ty. I am Nandu Gili, the Bunyip Elder. G'day, mate! It's time you knew the truth. Years ago, a great battle was fought over the fate of five mystic talismans. Those brave few who challenged Boss Cass were trapped in the dreaming. Mom? Dad? Word grows that Boss Cass is seeking out the talismans again. He must be stopped at all costs. It's up to you to find the talismans before he does. 
It's up to me to save my family. Oi, Ty! Are you okay? Murray? Oh, am I glad to see you. Oh, you're never gonna believe what just happened. I was playing in the forest when the ground suddenly... And that's when you showed up. Ruth! Sounds like you've got a fair deacon adventure ahead of you, mate. Not that I'm into that sort of thing. I'd much rather be at home watching the footy. But I tell you what. You do the adventuring and I'll help you out where I can. Rainbow Cliff sounds nice. Welcome to Rainbow Cliffs, mate. Thank you. By the way, whenever you see one of these signs, I won't be far away. I've heard that if you press the action button, you can talk to me, whatever that means. Okay, now let's get down to brass tacks. If you're gonna be out adventuring, then you'll need another boomerang. And I know just the place to find one. <laughs> Head down to Bly Bly Station. I'll meet you there. Okay. Here we go then. Seems fairly straightforward. G'day, Julius. Now, if I just reroute these wires to... I said g'day, mate. I is deaf. Oh, goodness gracious me. Oh, I didn't see you there. I was just making some last-minute adjustments. Well, 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 you must be Ty. G'day. So, you old coot. <laughs> What's this contraption do? <laughs> This contraption is the key to finding the talisman. Why is this so? It's quite simple, really. It uses an oscillatory microfeeder to scan for trace energy signals that match the unique power matrix of the talisman. Huh? Mm, like a big nose that sniffs them out. Oh. Ah. Oh. And thunder eggs are the key to powering the machine. Thunder eggs? Oh, they're as rare as hen's teeth, mate. Couldn't you just use batteries? <clears throat> if only it was that easy. You see, this machine doesn't just find where the talismans are, it actually teleports them here. Struck me lucky. And that, my friends, requires a great deal of energy. So, uh, how is Ty here going to find all these thunder eggs? Eh, hey, I was just wondering that myself. A reasonable question. I've created these portals to lead Ty to areas rich with them. Of course, they won't just be lying all over the place. Just our luck. A lot of them will have already been found. The trick will be convincing the locals to part with their prized possessions. But I'm afraid I can't help you with that. If you're as resourceful as they say, Ty, I'm sure you'll think of something. Righto, Ty. There's no point in mucking about. You've got to find a second boomerang. I'll see you in two up. Okay, so let's find two up then. Must be this one. to enter. This billabong has got the lot. Gum trees, wallabies, and even a koala. <laughs> There's plenty to do here, so let's get a move on. Listen, mate, I solved your problem. I found you a second boomerang. That's great. Where is it? See that tree over there? Yeah. Well, it's not there. Right. Well, where is it? It's on top of Frillneck Peak. Oh, great. 
Oh, don't worry. You'll just have to jump, run, rang, and bite your way there while avoiding Boss Cass's henchmen. Look, mate, life wasn't meant to be easy. Seventy-one to go. <laughs> Come on, let's get a move on. <laughs> All right, bossy. I reckon those dunnies are a complete waste of space. <laughs> Only last week I used one, walked two blocks, was clobbered by a frill, and then woke up back on the dunny. Which was the best place to be, given the surprise I got. Julius reckons it's got something to do with the space-time conundrum. But if you ask me, I think it's a load of bull dust. So you're saying that if I have an accident, I'll end up back at one of these? Something like that. Got a fair set of choppers on you. I reckon you could put them to good use by pressing the bite button. <laughs> Get it? It's choppers, bite button. <laughs> Never mind, Ty, move on. Have a go at those crates. Speaking to a bloke down the local watering hole, and he reckons you can use your rangs to take care of enemies and smash things. You ripper! He said something now, wait a minute, he said something about pressing the throw button to use them. <laughs> Struth! What happened here? Boss Cass did this. He's caged all your bilby mates and hidden them across the land. Oh, yeah? Well, big mistake. No one messes with my mates. Now, there's a thunder egg in each area if you free them. No worries. Unless you're Boss Cass. It's true, but I heard about this bloke who found 300 opals, then took them to Julius's opal machine. Anyway, something weird happened, and he ended up with a thunder egg. <laughs> right, eh? Thank <laughs> you. 
Ah! Didn't realize it was running out of time. Oh, there's a Gengar here as well. Okay. Just might do. Get I, Julius. Oh, hello, Ty. You, you know this golden cog just might be perfect for my latest invention. The cogulaceous boom rangorous extrapolator. What a name. Right. What's that? Why, it's a machine that creates experimental techno rangs. I need golden cogs to build a new one. Fifteen to be exact. And if you find enough, bring them to my lab in Rainbow Cliffs, and I'll build you a new boomerang. You're on, mate. I think I can get there just yet. From what I can remember, I think you have to finish the level and then go back to it. you this, but I have no idea what it means. Apparently, according to Julius, you can lock your camera on to enemies at any time by pressing and holding the lock on button. I didn't know you could do that. Hey, there's a new thing.
Well, I wouldn't have believed it if I didn't see it with my own eyes. <laughs> you actually found the second boomerang. Well, there's no time to sit around and feel all pleased with yourself. You're gonna have to put that new ring to use. You see, I had a thunder egg I was gonna give you, but a bunch of frills stole it. You'll have to take them all on to get it back. I get the impression that uh, Spurge guy, I can't even remember his name, uh, is quite lazy. <laughs> There we go. You can. Just let that out of the water. It looks like today wasn't a complete waste of time. <laughs> you seem to have learned a thing or two. Oh, yeah, you're too right. Uh, you know, there's one other thing I could show you, but uh, I don't know if you're ready for it yet. Yeah? Well, what's that? Well, a mate of mine who knows a mate who knows a mate who knows another mate says you can use two boomerangs to glide long distances. How? It's simple, really. You jump, then press and hold jump again to start gliding. Right. Is that safe? <laughs> safe as houses, mate. See if you can glide across this gap to reach that thunder egg. Look at that. Me mate's mate, mate, mate was telling the truth after all. <laughs> Just as well I didn't call for an ambulance. <laughs> well, lad, you made it through with flying colours. And as a little extra bonus, a stopwatch will appear near the start. OK. What's that for? The racetrack. You can race the clock to win another thunder egg. Right. I'll give that a go later. <laughs> well, that's enough gas bagging from me. Let's head back to the Bly Bly station. <laughs> yeah, I think I might try the stop sock. Bring up magic mushrooms. Welcome to the track. Race to the finish as fast as you can, mate. The checkpoints will lead the way. But miss one and the race is over. <laughs> Good luck. Very aggressive. was a ripper of a race, Ty. You're faster than a long-legged emu with a case of the belly aches. <laughs> case of the belly aches. I reckon you've earned this. Oh, you beauty! Okay. 
Okay, so now that I've got the second boomerang, I should be able to reach that area that I couldn't before. So let's just go like that. Wasn't a half bad effort, Ty. I reckon with a little more practice, you'll get there. Cool!
that's the first. First one. Oh, I found it! Oh, I found it! Let me see that. At last, a mystic talisman. It's time to move out. We got four more talismans to find. You there, fetch my bags. <laughs> Soon, unimaginable power will be mine, mine, mine. <laughs> so there we go then. So that's the first bit done. Yes, mm -hmm. yes, Thunder Eggs power this talisman machine. Make sure you visit all the portals. Okay. Oh, that bit's open now. What's wrong here? I think from what I remember last time I played this, it's quite a big area down here. And we've got all these rainbow scales we can collect. There's one. There's two. Oh, you little ripper, Ty! You found a fair dinkum rainbow scale! When you find enough, take them to the Bunyip Elder at Rainbow Cliffs. I told you already. Find 15 golden cogs and bring them to my lab in Rainbow Cliffs. I'm just going to struggle all the way along here.
so carry on. Oh, don't mind me. Shipwrecks. Let's go. Welcome to the Great Barrier Reef. Full of beautiful fish, friendly natives, and inviting sandy beaches. It's a beaut spot for a swim, if you know how. Good to see you again. G'day, Rex. You saved anyone today? Funny you should say that. Elle went for a bit of a swim out near Danger Spike. Danger Spike? Where's that, Rex? It's a nice little spot, not too far from Shark Reef. Yeah, and? Well, anyway, she's an excellent swimmer, but she hasn't come home yet. I'm starting to get a bit worried. Strafe? I'm on lifeguard duty, so could you have a look for me? Well, I would, mate, but I, I can't swim. Tell you what, I'll teach you. Follow me. When you're in water, press the bite button to dive. Then tap the jump button to start swimming. OK. Wish me luck. By the way, those boomerangs of yours won't work underwater. But i got a prezzy for you that'll fix that. These are aquarangs. I found them in an old shipwreck years ago. They cut through water like a hot knife through butter. If you can dive under the water and grab them, well, then they're all yours. Okay, so. Ooh, is... Nope. Just run around the beach a little bit to start with. one. The aquarangs work like regular boomerangs, but you can only use them underwater. Oh, and one other thing. You're not a fish, mate, so keep an eye on your air supply. Yeah, thanks, Rex. Use the aquarang to hit this switch. It'll open the shark door so you can be on your way. Sweet.
great work, Ty. You've learned how to swim and use those aquarangs. With a bit of practice, you'll be a champion swimmer just like me. Dear Betty. This is my good mate. She'll show you the way to danger, Spike. Good luck, mate. Hey, Ty. You can swim faster by tapping the jump button to gain speed. <laughs> Let's go find Elle. There we go. Hey, Ty. No!
idea where I'm meant to be going now. Dearie me, my sweet little angels have wandered off exploring. Now I can't find them anywhere. Please, can you help me? Okay, so now we've got to try and find the little sea dragons. There they go. There's one of them. Towards me, that is not good. I do not like it. Ah! But where are the others? Oh, no, obviously not. Um, okay, let's see. Fine. Hey, Ty. Oh, is that one? Oh, 
No, it's quicksand. Nope. Oh, I didn't realise that, that was quicksand. Oh well. Good thing I got that life just before I died. This last sea dragon. Through the mines we go again. Maybe I should follow the opals and see where that leads me. There they are. Next, still one more to go. My babies, my precious babies. Thank you so much, little orange fish creature. How can I ever repay you? <laughs> hey, I know. You can have this sparkly rock I found in the sand. All right. So I don't know if that was the most grateful Yay. thank you ever, little orange fish creature. But we'll, we'll roll with it. Okay, so I would like to get back over here. Let's see if we can speed over that way. There we go. Careful, Ty. Those eels look pretty nasty. Follow me. Really following Stay out of the way of those sharks! They're big meanies! Press the action button to swim into the cage. Press the action button again to swim out. Okay, let's just backtrack for now. Because I definitely miss something else here. I'm not being eaten by another fish again. No! 
No! Oh, come on. There we go, there's the cave entrance. So, this is how you get up here. It would have been just easier to go and get it first. But... Let's go! Uh, I think I'll head back to that big sand area. This is definitely more to do up here. the 
still dance. everything around here. the X button. scary. I don't know what to do now, and they have just uh, left me to it. Oh, there it is. Okay, let's see.
thing. Oh, <laughs> that was a mistake. What? I don't know which. There we go. This was just getting ridiculous. Man. There we go. That's all I needed to do. I think if this 
this was me in real life having to run up this hill, I would not be doing anywhere near as well as this, especially if you have to pull this off the ledge. Well, that must be L. Hey, doll. How are you? Yeah, good. And what about you? Let me guess. Rex was worried about me again? Yeah, that's right. Isn't he a sweetheart? Well... I better get home so he stops fretting. Right, I then. By the way, I found this on the way. Want it? How am I still missing some? Okay, there's quite a few that I've missed. Where do I need to go? Oh, this one. Oh, that must be the opal one. It's a shipwreck somewhere. I thought it was just the star. I thought it would be better. This place is very much. So now let's have a look. Oh, this one right here. Uh. So, Ty, are you up for a race? Mm -hmm. See if you can keep up. Thank <laughs> you. 
Nope, I missed one. Oh, that's it. It's over. You've got to keep inside the course, okay? Okay, let's try again. Ready to try again? I'll go easy on you this time. I have to die. That's what it is. Oh, no. Going easy on me really fast. I can't see the rings right here. Why is he going so fast? Come on, come on, come on. can beat me I've trained you well mate my uh, swimming coach gave this to me when I first beat him in a race now I want you to have it gee thanks mate cool where to next then okay ship Hmm. Don't quite know how we get there. Oh, let's, let's head over anyway. Be another way, I think. Now.
good. So it's just that one. There must be another way through. give up on this one. Never mind. Walk in the park. Let's do that. Fresh rainforest there. See the cute wallabies. Surf the slippery water slide. Watch out for those leeches. G'day, Ty. Our good friend Shazza can get herself into a pickle sometimes. This time, her truck has broken down at the end of the forest road. Yoo-hoo! But if that isn't bad enough, I spotted some blue tongue lizards nearby. <laughs> you reckon you can give her a hand? Shoot bet, I'm on my way.
Gecko! Oops. Just sort of in between the feet there. Well, I'm heading down this way now, whether I like it or not. There it is. Serious break dancing. Here's some free advice. Certain enemies deflect gerangs with their thick skins, but are hopeless against those pearly whites of yours. <laughs> so sometimes you have to bite the bad guy.
Listen, Ty, before you tackle this water slide, there are a few things you need to know. You can speed up and duck under the logs by pressing the bite button. And you can slow down by pulling back on the movement stick. Let's go for it, man. Just go slow to solid because I don't really want to have to do this again just to get all the opals. G'day, Cobber. <sighs> G'day, Ranger Ken. I need a favour, mate. There's a flock of cave bats in there. Cave bats? It's nearly the wet season, and we need to move them out before the caves flood. No worries. We'll do that first. Let's...
go into the bat cave and go to the room box. This is a of bat. It's all this, um, basically, the bats fix me. Because that's good. Here's something for your troubles. Oh, you beauty!
Just take it. For goodness sake. I'll deal with that in a second. So I didn't realise that it would take me right to the start of the water slide, so just bear with me a few seconds. We'll be there in just a few seconds more. And this is longer than I thought it was. Almost died right at the end there, I think. So hard. This is like a weird angle perspective. Oh, right. Let's stay here. I'll do it again. There we go. Just make sure we've got everything.
it's coming from. No, 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 no! I am not doing well on this bit. Ah! Oh my god, give me a hot stuff. Shivers! Ah, oh, Ty, am I glad to see you. Would you mind keeping those blue tongues off me back while I fill up my watering bottle? No worries. Thanks, Possum. Hit the boulders with your rang so they knock the blue tongues out of the way. Okay, this, this is going to be very hard. Thanks heaps for what you did back there, Possum. Ah, no worries. By the way, I found this at the creek. You want it? Shoe ripper! Well, I better get a move on. See you soon, Possum. Okay, so there's still two that I haven't got. There's one more bilby I need to find. And the wombat race. We can try and do it.
go back to rainbow cliffs for now. I think we might just have enough of the golden cogs, which is exciting. Excuse me, everybody. Jolly good die. You've collected enough thunder eggs to power the machine. Let's give it a go, shall we? Outstanding! Simply outstanding! The energy levels are off the scale, and, 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 yes, yes, I've got a lock on one of the talismans! Stand back, Ty! It's coming through!
Well done, Tai. You've retrieved the first of the ancient talismans. When Boss Cass discovers that we are out to thwart his plans, he will do all in his power to stop you. Be careful, my friend. She'll be right, old timer. Shock me, lucky you actually found the talisman. I just might have bet on the wrong horse. Anyway, mate, Julius has got a present for you at his lab. I've made <laughs> a most exciting discovery. The talisman machine is brimming with excess energy from the Fire Thunder eggs. By diverting that energy to my special hyper techno boomerang maker, I can make special elemental rangs. Watch. Simply smashing, I present to you the Flamerang. You beauty! Yes, yes, this ring can start fires and melt ice. It even has a more powerful effect on some enemies. To select it, use the previous rang and next rang buttons to cycle through your collection. It will aid you well in your quest. Now, do try it out. Oh, my! you found enough golden cogs, haven't you? These will be perfect for my latest invention. I call it the Cogulacious Boomerangerous Extrapolator. Ty, it's a machine I designed to create cutting-edge techno rangs. Oh, my! This is... Very nice. It's a zoomerang. <laughs> built in. The ties view button to activate it. Use the movement stick to aim and the camera stick to zoom in and out on enemies for greater throwing accuracy. Now worries. To select it, use the previous rang and next rang buttons to cycle through your collection. So I've got two new ranks. Okay, so I think that's probably a good place to stop for today. Thanks very much for watching, really hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, if you'd like to see me play some more of Ty, then just let me know in the comments. Next up in the series, I'll be playing some Pokemon Legends, but also keep an eye out for Animal Crossing, Super Mario Galaxy, and a bit of Mario Kart 2. Um, there's some new race courses available, so I'll give those a try. If you would like to donate or have another look at my campaign, QR code is just there, the link. And um, yeah, check out my Twitter and Instagram pages as well. Thanks very much, guys. Look forward to seeing you soon.